kick this out. Let's kick this off. Kick this. Kick this going. Soccer mom. How did we used to start these things? Yo, Ashley and Dane mindset episode one, season two, and today we're gonna talk about blah 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 blah, and then bam, then the intro thing comes in, and then we. Come I wanna back cry. In. You know what I mean? Do you like that? Yeah. Right back I memories. missed it. Yeah, here we go. It's it's gonna, I'm cool. gonna cry the whole time. You can do I it. Bring it, bring it. So much. Yeah, I bring love it. it. I, I love us so much. That was good. Yo, Ashley, Dane, mindset. You know we're back at it. Um, episode one, season two, and uh, I think we are. Uh, we're just gonna let you guys know what we've been up to. So stay tuned. Be me, me, me. I love our song. When I hear our song, I get goosebumps. So I was gonna ask you. Am I you, spoiled? No. So I was gonna ask you no. if. Okay. Cool. Don't even like. Don't even do that. Don't even think about it because it's like. Because I had a few things. No. Running. Okay, cool. Like it literally fuels my soul, Dane. Like you cannot change it. I literally hear that song. And, I like, do feel like that is. Nipples get hard. Yep. Eyes dilate. Yep. Like I tune the fuck in. Like yeah. if we could play it right now, I'd be like hyped. It just I'd be played. getting like that. Like ding. ding. It, oh shit! Now. Play it. What's up, guys? Um, it's been a long time. It's been a bit, but we're back. Uh huh. We're glad to be back. Very happy to be back. And we're glad you guys are back with us. So, with that being said, um, we are definitely trying to like um, network and reach out. So we, um, I got my little notes here. Um, you can find us like our. Our episodes are going to be on YouTube, mm -hmm. so you can check that out at um, Diamond Mind Productions. Um, that's Mind M I N D mm -hmm. Production. So check that out. Subscribe. More subscribers we get, uh, then the faster we can go live on YouTube, and then you guys can check us out and yell at us if you want, or right. comment really cool things and make us like respond to them, because like we can I can't ignore people, you know. Yeah. That's not a thing I'm good at. So what have you been up to? I don't know. Are you not going in guns blazing? Are you Are you being... Somebody said that I come in guns blazing every time. I don't know. I mean, I usually... I have a lot of energy, and I'm super excited, but I just feel like Ashley, like, four years ago was just very different than, like, Ashley now. That was also said. Yeah, see? That's not wild. And, like, the fact that people know that, like, just speaks more highly to the change and like the person I am now, so I'm definitely like proud of that. You yeah, know? yeah. But I uh, know I'm definitely still height, just not as height. It's true. Yeah. You'll be seeing some of the behind the scenes footage, and you'll be like, oh, she's shit. still hype. She, she's <laughs> yeah, she's still hype. Hype, yeah. hype. And I'll probably get hype like as we keep going, because I'm just like trying to. Right now, we're like, you know, like we're reason like back into the pool. Yeah, yeah, this is like the fourth play of Easing, the show. You know what I mean? In. Like, we're we're just trying to figure out, you know. We want to also figure out, like, through doing introductions and doing our explaining and things like that, like, we are going to fall back into, like, our patterns and our routine, which is exactly what we need, and then things will just start happening more naturally, and maybe I'll just start going a little more crazy. I don't know. It's true. Yeah. Once the once the spirit gets in you, Yeah. that's what's going to happen. Yeah. Um, where else can we find us? Um, Twitch. Well, what were you going to say? I was going to say Facebook. We can start with Twitch. Oh, we can do Facebook? Because that's all you. I was <laughs> on all YouTube. Me. You yeah. were on Facebook. So, uh, the, the thing, one of the things that happened it, that was a big change, I think, like in my life, like, and it'll lead into where we're going with the Facebook thing, is um, like I stopped modeling and I got off social media for quite a few years. Like I literally just got Facebook back like a couple months ago. And um, I think that that really changed a lot for me because I really did stop, like, giving a fuck what anybody else, like, was saying or doing. And I really just tuned in and, like, buckled down with my kids and all. But that being said, like, Dane is also taking, like, a social media hiatus right now. 
from Facebook. So part of the reason I reactivated the Facebook in the first place was definitely to get back Take to one for the having team. mindset. Yeah. yeah. So it definitely is taking one for the team, by the way, because it's rough out there. And one of the segments that we'll start getting into in our next couple episodes are like some like questionable Facebook posts and like kind of talking definitely. about, you know, like, I mean, I've already literally, I think I had it three days before I posted a status that said something about how I do not like how social media can like kind of warp your mind and your feelings. So, but if you're on there and you use it, that's cool. That's good. Yeah, good and for like you. us because it's just mindset. Yeah, the podcast. So, and you can find it through my page if you need to, but I think you can just find it like on your own. Yeah, you can just type it just in. Just type check it us in. Out. Like search it. You know. And if you're on Twitch, you can follow us there. Mindset underscore podcast. Love it. And same for Discord. Uh, we're going to try that. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I'm getting old, but it's really confusing. I like Discord. So might have to, I might have to pass the torch over to Ashley. Or maybe we'll just take an episode to uh, learn it. And you all can learn it with me, and then we can all communicate on there, and that'd be cool. Yeah, I think it's one of those things where once you, like, know how to use it and, like, learn how valuable some of those tools are, like, just having different forms for different things and just how easy it is to, like, when you're already on there to, like, link up into other things that you're interested in that are, like, like-minded or whatever. Yeah, it's a good uh, community-based type deal. So, and that, I think that's what we're trying to go for it this is. season, maybe? It is. Uh, we said the the one thing that we discussed like right before this was definitely just more loose. I feel like we were very tight before, and we used to be very critical. Like we would like jump over our words and stuff. We used to like cut it out. Like yo, but we killed it. The we whole know we did. We we did from the beginning to the end. It just it just got better towards the end, and then you know. Then life happened, and we. Am had, I a loser we, that like I was watching like our old episodes for the last four years, and I'm still like obsessed? Like I don't think I am. I think that we like literally, like had such a good thing going, and yeah, I mean, I got pregnant. So I got sick. It's true, I got sick too. You Not because she got sick, but I did. I was get gonna sick. say, what? <laughs> okay, I was like, did I get you sick? No. <clears throat> but yeah, no. You almost uh, got me pregnant, I think. Yeah, that is contagious, for sure. Super. You gotta watch out for that. I dropped cookies off one time, and when I, when I don't know I had morning sickness. Yeah, bloated and cankles. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, it definitely wasn't the best pregnancy ever. And then, uh, I mean, now my daughter's three, and she'll be four in October, so that just, like, shows you how much time has actually passed between, like, then and now. Like, now I have a nine-year-old son. That's crazy. That plays soccer. It's crazy. Yeah, being a soccer mom is, is crazy. Like, that whole vibe is just, like, a totally different thing. Like, I am the only one yelling at practices and games, I feel like, sometimes. <laughs> and it's because I'm just so passionate. Like, I cannot help it. But I'm also just mad competitive. Yeah, I was going to say, sometimes, like, uh, <laughs> when you're passionate about something, you lose focus of what's around you. And oh, no, you I just do. start going 100%. crazy. Like... I will, yeah, I'm like, I'm like, Jason, you have to stay with the ball. You have to stay with the ball. You have to if he was in the zone as much as you were, you we, know would, We wouldn't even need to have these conversations at all. So that's what we're working on and, like, awareness of where the ball is and where you are in relation to the ball and the goal. This is his first year, so he's got, like, a lot to learn. But I also first year is the top. I have a lot to learn. Yeah, it's just very hard to watch youth sports in general. (laughs) As an adult, you want to jump in and get to show them how it's done. Like, let me in, coach. You know. What else we got? What else? Oh, that's it. Oh, just kidding. Is it? Are we kidding? (laughs) I think the only other thing, like the only other thing I have to say, is that like i unfortunately like things did not work out with avery's dad which is something that like we touched base on like the last couple episodes especially like we had him on the show our first episode ever he was on the show so like no like no hard feelings at all but like now like ashley's single again which is wild <laughs> woo, woo. yeah like not available but single and also my mom is now single as of literally what like 15 minutes before we started recording this episode. It's true. So, like, all I got to say is... So, fuck you, Dennis! But, like, Dennis. Yeah, not that right, Fuck you, Dennis, all right, for dumping my mom on a Saturday over a phone call. But anyway, my mom's single now. So, available. So, we gave her... We tried to give her some advice. We are saying about... That yep. other person's making a choice, and yep. it, you know you kind of have to be okay with the choice. Mm-hmm. Like, 
rejection sucks. It nobody nobody likes rejection. But you don't want to be with somebody who doesn't want to be with you. Right. Like it's so, very simple. So once you start figuring out uh, being by yourself and figuring yourself out, I, like I, I told her, I said, you know, you, you become very dangerous because you don't rely on anybody. So when you find somebody, there's really yep. everything is just it's it's right there it's it doesn't have to be because you need this or you need that it's just you enjoy the company and make life easier and more enjoyable because right. life's crazy sometimes yeah you gotta stay safe out there you gotta take care of yourself you also just need to be nice be nice that would be like you know maybe like a good place to start too like before you go buy a gun maybe you just start being nice you can be nice and buy a gun. No, I know. I'm just saying. Like, Speaking maybe, of which, like, yo, we might have a, a full episode of nothing about guns. <laughs> and all it's going to be about is guns. Taking them apart, what kind of bullets they shoot. I have a really good gun story, too. What so, they can go through. So we'll, we'll talk about my gun story, and then we'll talk about how funny it is that we're doing a full episode on guns. Because so, of the story. Yeah, so you guys have to... You guys have, have tune to tune into that. Yeah, tune in. We're definitely. also going to do just an episode where we watch sad things and see how quick I cry whole episode of that how fast you cry right oh my god yeah it's like yeah we can like try to break you down with stuff but i don't think like you cry over tv shows or movies no, like i no. literally get so emotionally invested sometimes like there's certain things that we can watch and i probably will break down every single even time. if you've seen it a hundred times I do, yep prime example the rugrats movie when tommy's in the closet holding Stu's slipper and he's singing the song about like wanting his parents back and like they're just taking care of like baby Stu. not Stu. what's it dill baby dill he's just like i want mom and dad for me I, it's bad it's it's sad it's literally stayed with me that orange fucking videotape has stayed with me for 33 years of life i'll be 33 this year so the, the i feel like the first time you saw that you became so emotionally oh my God. attached every time you watch it it just like, fucked me up more like five like, ten honestly. minutes before that that spot and comes now in that having video, two you, kids, I like I'm like Jackson. Do you feel like like fucking Tommy? Like, am no, I? No, no, he's fine. No, he's fine for sure. But like, I'm just saying, like, there was definitely moments where I was like, oh my gosh, like this could happen. I need to make sure I love my kids like equally and put the equal effort in. You know? I think you do. I, no, I, I do. 100. I think, you're good. I think sure. you're good to go. I don't think you should question that. Yo, when stupid people say dumb stuff about your body or anything like that, don't oh, listen no, to Oh, no. We're talking about nothing. this I'm just now. saying. I'm just saying. Somebody told don't. me I gained weight yesterday, and it, like, really upset me. And But, like, not in, like, I don't know. Well, yeah, I was upset at first I'm a woman. But then, eventually, I, like, reminded myself, like, that I'm a bad bitch and that, like, my ass is just fat right now. Because I'm, like, happy because I've been eating a lot more. Because, like, I have somebody that's, like, taking me out to dinner more and, like, making me snack sometimes, you know? And she was eat she she had some, some cherry tomatoes as a snack. Grab she was, that was a healthy, healthy choice decision, right? I was like, proud I'm of improving. you. Like, by the day, like, I'm snacking on fucking tomatoes, okay? Like, I, like, I'm gonna eventually, like, probably go back to snacking on all the horrible shit I was snacking on. But, chocolate. that being said, yeah, like, 100% chocolate, ice cream, uh, Dunkaroos, chips. Oh, man. Full-out sandwiches, pickles, charcuterie boards, you know, all the things. And I had, what? I went to Country Corner in Reinhold's the other day. Yo, and just I had, think about that, It was please. 8 o'clock at night, and I had... Country fried. No, buffalo pull, buffalo dip, like chicken buffalo dip, like the spicy buffalo dip on fries. And a uh, cherry coke flute. Like, so, yeah, like mama be looking a little thick, but like mama's also very happy. I was going to say she's And it's also... really not that bad. I'm wrong with being happy. No, and there's like, it's not that bad. I'm extremely happy right now. I'm happier than I've been probably in as long as I can really remember and put like my finger on it but it's like what you said about <clears throat> like the not needing anything from anybody else I think like within the years that we weren't doing this that's definitely something that like I found for myself and I definitely didn't feel that way before so I like love that I mean I know I loved myself then but like it's like a full acceptance love now like I love everything about me yeah and I think um I think that's like a like that's our mantra thing with our like mindset is like you seriously really no one's gonna love you like you, like you love, can love you yeah like 100%. you love yourself and you gotta be like super gentle with yourself and your thoughts like 
like you got to take care of yourself mentally and you can't let outside things like this crazy guy be trying to break you down to make him feel better you just you just gotta block it out and just remember how happy and and Cherry tomatoes, healthy choices you're making. So you know yeah, what I mean. Yeah, just like What's making minor, just... making minor improvements for sure. Just because, like I, like I said, my underwear was fitting a little tight the other day for sure. You said it was because they maybe just came out of the dryer, but I don't know. That's what I thought. The ass is also just like mad fat lately. So like I feel like maybe just tighten it up a little bit for summertime. It's about to be bikini season. I'm gonna be wearing my fucking like high cut foam bikini, like everywhere basically. A couple you know. of months, that could be like episode six with the uh, <coughs> bikini car wash. <laughs> they, 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 the, the bikini <laughs> unveiling the bikini. I said I wasn't modeling anymore, so I feel like us backtracking back into that is like a big thing too. Well, I'm confused where that went. It kind of sounded like you were being a big pussy, and you're like, "No, I'm not going to do it because I, I quit modeling." It's not even like, like a pussy thing. Uh, first of all, no, I'm asking we if know that were... like it, back in the day, I would just get naked in front of like anybody, and it never bothered me. And it, like now, I just know the power that like me being naked holds. So like I'm just not showing that to like just anybody. You know, so like Feel that's you. my thing. Bikini's Feel totally you. different. Like I would do bikini. Well, I don't know what the fuck we're washing a car for, but like you know what I mean. Like that's fine. Like I would much rather like do something else in the bikini. Like comment at the bottom if <laughs> if we would give a location of the bikini car wash and if you would bring your car through. As long as that or motorcycle. Like we we'll have two lanes so we don't get jammed. I'll have up. to find other girls like in bikinis too. Like I can't <laughs> no, it's you by uh, yourself. Are you doing all the like, labor by myself? By this the is some dive, shit, like... Dane. Well, better be for like a good cause. Like. Ball cancer or something. So mindset. Very specific. What like better cause would that be? Ball cancer. Like I said, <laughs> like mindset. What, the... what would be you know? <laughs> I don't want to wash a bunch of cars, Dave. Dude, are you here eighty five point three percent? Are you here a hundred? Okay, it's a hundred. Like right. it's fine. Mindset. Like, I have to wash some cars. Mindset. Like fine, but like I'm definitely gonna get all like, donations, all proceeds. Anybody wants to volunteer to help me as well, feel free to let me know. You know? Yeah, but oh. it's not like it. Do you remember the, um, we were talking about the phone idea, too. We were also throwing around the idea of getting a phone. <laughs> like a hotline. Like a bat signal. Remember? It's true. You, you could call in. <laughs> and like, 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 like when we have the live, you know what I'm saying? Like, but I'm thinking, like, could, all right. We're going to have to hire somebody to screen the calls before comment, we get the Comment down here. It... W- would a Skype, would Skype work oh, better? Oh, yeah. We did, you did say that. As, if we would be able to broadcast it through, like... Would you, you yeah, know, would you sit in this like, chat room with all these people and then come in and say hi to us? Which yeah. I feel like brings you guys closer together, brings us closer together with yeah. you, and then, like, also just, like, good vibes all around. Yeah. Good vibes Like, maybe, around. like, we did, like, a, um... Something on Discord or something where we we pick you know a couple people or right. we have a uh, just you got to comment and then the more times you comment the better chance of at a random Whatever. draw yeah you would get and you can come on and say say your piece yeah you can say your piece or ask us a question or ask or us for advice get jerky whatever you want to do give me attitudes you true. know like if you're feeling froggy just leap yep. whatever. <laughs> <laughs> That's why we see guns and blazes, yo. I'm getting there, Dan. I'm warning. I'm warming. We're warming. We're yeah. on preheat right now. I feel pre-heat, it. Preheat, you know? Episode three, man. I feel like that's going to be... Like when I'm back fully. It's wild. Oh, yeah. man. I'll be like shrieking in the back. Because like... what's going to happen is you're going to watch this episode and then you, you're just going to... I really gonna, come back. <laughs> yeah, you're just going to be like, all right, I know what I'm doing next time. First of all, I'm like, so be like, so mature. So poised. That's because we got these notes and everything. I have, I have li- literally little notes. We had note cards last time, I think. We used to do note cards, yeah, which I think was fine. But I also, like, that was what I was saying earlier. I feel like, just like your brother said, like, that natural flow that we have, like, you don't really need, like, we were focusing way too much on hitting fucking bullet points when, like, in reality, like, us just being near each other is, like, the vibe. It's magic. It really is. Like, in a very weird... To other people, very sexual way. Like we, you know, we know what we're, we know what's happening on the other side. It's true. Like, and if this is your first season, be ready you, to be turned on. 
by us. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> it's fine. I wasn't writing anyway anymore. If this is your first season, yeah, you're you're um. Uh, what did oh. they miss? Let's tell them what did they miss in oh, the first season. Like, shit. let's just sum it up. Oh man. Um. Well, I think um we had lots of special guests. Yeah, we did. Unfortunately, I think we sh uh, we did not get to have David writing all. Bam, 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 bam! But we did give a shout out to David writing every episode. Every episode. I never. Uh, we never forgot. I'm Even if we did it in the in the <laughs> beginning, I would remember like halfway through, and I'd be like, oh, I get to do the air horns. So. I think, um, so this season, I, we need to get him on. Like or some we way. might tease you and maybe have him on season three. Who knows? Well, we're, we're going to see. We're going to see. Maybe we Skype him and he wears um, like a ski mask. Maybe. Like he's in there, but he's not in you'd there. You'd have to you guess. Don't know who you'd he You'd have is. to guess our special guest. Oh, I like that. Guest our, guest, I like guest, that. Guest yeah, guest. just mystery special guest. Yeah, I know we did a lot of special guests, um, all types from artists. Yeah. Uh, as far as painters, uh, we did, we did uh, musicians, we photographers. did um, photographers. Uh, yeah, we did like a live gamers. tour of gamers. We did live tour of a uh, studio, a photography studio. We did live tour of the fucking um, the video game thing, the tournament. Yep, we did. Yeah, uh, the hookah lounge. Um, there was a, what was that? A Smash Brothers tournament. We went there. That was that was really neat. Um, yeah, man. You More got, um, field trips this year. That's yeah, the other. We're, like, yeah, that's we're gonna try to do goal. some some field trip stuff. More field trips. Um, and then hopefully we'll be able to live stream for you guys. Uh, but we gotta get subscribers on YouTube. On YouTube, we almost made it last time. We were so close. Yeah. Which I feel like a lot of you are probably still subscribed. So when this comes out, you're gonna be like, oh my gosh, Damn. it's happening again. Look out. I know, and it's like definitely a thing. A thing. I feel like you know. And I, I also feel like the the other main thing that will help us into the new transition, too, is just, like, our new attitudes, you know what I'm saying? Because, like, I'm not the only one that changed, you know? I changed a little bit. It's been three years, you know? Yeah, I mean, like, I grew up a little bit. I'm, a yeah. little, I'm like, three I years would hope older. You, I would hope you weren't the same person as you were three years ago, because then it would be like, you know, like, have you, like, there's no growth. But there's progression. There's uh, constant progression. I know there probably was, but I was super dope back then. Still pretty super dope now. You were pretty cool. You were pretty cool. You're still pretty cool. I'll give that to you. I'll say that. Oh God, what are you doing? <laughs> I always just have mine on the table. You know. I don't know if that's like a new thing to do. <coughs> Feel like the is. other thing that was a like a rule last time that I feel like kind of worked against us was we never like had our phones like we always had our phones on silent and not with us like we never had our phones like in easy ready access one it's to true. catch awesome amazing phone calls randomly but two like so I can like be like hey have you ever heard of this like watch this you know I got you like for example noodling I'm gonna pull up a video about noodling that's what I'm gonna teach you today I'm teaching you about noodling I'm gonna teach everybody else about noodling one of my friends asked me if I've ever seen people noodle before and I said is that a sexual thing that's what it sounds like and it is not is it a handshake it is catching catfish oh with your hand yeah but it's like literally the scariest fucking thing I have ever seen yeah because you don't know if it's a catfish that's down there because it's murky water I'm correct Yes. And, like, you're literally, like, they're in holes, I think, is where they usually are, like, in a hole. All right, so I'm going to just pull up, like, this is, like, a chick doing it. And, like, look, she's, like, going underwater. Like, you don't even know what you're going under there, too. It's murky. You can't see There's shit. There's nothing. Yeah, like, we can see this guy, like, his shoulder. Oh, yeah. There it sounds her like. feet just went up. Oh, did you hear her laugh? Oh, my gosh. She got her. She left to the bow. Her fucking arm is like all the way down that cat. That catfish is deep throating her arm. So let's just talk about that. All right. So it's and the other arms all like all the way oh up my here. God. The catfish is probably the size of a I don't know. How does that make you feel? A lab. Well, not gonna lie, it's uh, it's probably why I don't go in the water much. Yeah. I like to kayak, like, but I like to stay on my, in my kayak. I don't, I don't like to uh, get out. And she was like kayak. bigger than me. So, like, I'm just thinking, like, that's a big fucking arm. That's a, like, that fish was, like, off the arm. Dude, if you would have lassoed the front of that, you could have rode that It said 30 pounds. Yeah, yeah dude, it said it was a 30-pound catfish. 
Yo, it's crazy as you get older, your body just can't keep up with your mind. And it's like, your mind's like, 21! I twisted my ankle on Easter because I fell off a step yelling at somebody else's kids. <laughs> And like soccer mom and, came yeah, out of you, dude, and then when it happened, well, I was following orders first of all, so I wasn't just like yelling at somebody's kid, but they told me to like go out there and yell, and I said, "All right, like I got this," and then I fucking just fell in front of all the kids. Damn. So I lost first of all, lost yeah. all sense of authority. Yep. Like you they are not taking you seriously now. anymore. And then two, they thought you were the entertainment. <laughs> the only kid that didn't see it was my nine-year-old son. Out of like the eight kids that were there, he was the only one that missed it somehow. But and he had, didn't really miss it. He probably seen you fall so many times that he was just like true but other, no but like at the same time he probably would have been the only one actually concerned because i mean i fell like my whole body hurt the next day because i fell on like concrete but also like my ankle was is still bruised but was bruised and swollen and looked way worse than any like both my pregnancies combined in the ankles cankle city down there getting old sucks it does like don't fall like, I mean, be, like I mean it. Like I mean it. It's like not even a joke. Like really, don't fall. Like life alert is real. Yo, <laughs> life alert is so real. Like I really like if nobody was there, I would have laid there for a long time. Maybe that's is that is that cheat code for life? It's like uh, same game, better graphics. Oh my god, maybe. No, because you get, like, your eyesight full of my, at least mine, I'm, my eyes are falling apart. Like, my eyesight's getting way worse now. Yeah, but soon you'll be able to put, like, remote control chippies in there and make your eyes see perfectly and Yeah, shit, true. You know I mean? um, AI stuff, that shit's crazy. You know what I mean? Who knows where that's going? Fucking Terminator. Yeah, that's great. That's not, and, like, and they never, they're, you know, just so we're all on the same page, robot eyes are always going to probably look wonky. Like, there's no way robot eyes are not going to look wonky. So, like, I'm just saying, like, you can't beat natural eyes. Right? Right. Like, let's be real. Being real. I've never seen robot eyes. I don't I don't think I've Terminator. ever. Terminator! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like, Terminator! Right. M movies and such. But I've never, like, I, I don't think I've ever seen, like, a... I used to go to Billy Bob's showbiz, and they had, like, a gorilla <laughs> band type deal with a bunch of animals. They had some fake eyes. They did look really weird, but I don't think I've ever seen, like, a... Like the Chuck E. Cheese band. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but I don't think I've ever seen like a human being or like a human. Uh huh. Like that a robot meant to look like a human with what are meant to look like human eyes. Okay. I don't think well, I've ever like seen Here's like the that. other thing. Like something like that would require like constant calibration. Okay, somehow. So whoever would be like coming up with these like robot eyes that are supposed to look like real eyes. Yeah. The calibration, like the balance, like the pupils being like facing this, like that would be like such a thing. Like there's no, I just like, how would you get that 100%? I just don't know if you really could. Your yeah. eyes automatically go there, and then they just kind of move and always float in that direction. I don't know. I've never seen a robot. I could be one right now. I'm not even sure. I was tired yesterday, and I didn't sleep much. And now I feel like I got a lot of energy. Red Bull <laughs> gives you gives you anxiety. It does. Yo, makes your heart feel <laughs> crazy. It does. It really does. I fucking love Red Bull though. It's like drinking fucking gasoline. Fucking right. Yeah, because you guns blazing. Like Damn straight. <laughs> it, 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 that's what's wrong with me. I didn't have Red Bull. I've been trying to cut back. We just itching. Like, oh, yeah, Red Bull, that's Red what Bull, it Bull, is. Red Bull. Red Bull. <laughs> this is exactly what happened. Why would you have to call it out though? Like now I feel I like a fiend. It's cool. It's whatever. I don't need. It. I got you, Hill. Yeah, we're going to put links on um, in the description of our YouTube video so you can catch us on uh, on our Twitch, on uh, Discord. Uh, if uh, if you're just like randomly watching this, you can subscribe and then check out our Twitch and our Discord. Both and slowly along. just begin to fall in love with us because yeah. that's what happens to everybody. Yeah, so it's mindset underscore podcast on both Twitch and Discord. So, and... Um, if uh, if you guys follow us and know, I, I'm not gonna mention anything right now on Instagram or anything. But if you guys follow us and know us, yo, you can just um, comment on one of our pictures or whatnot and holler us, holler at us. Yeah, we'll probably um, I'll probably make a mindset Instagram. Yeah, we'll try to get something going like that. And a TikTok. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. We did want to do. Uh, we want to do a, a TikTok, little... which is funny. Like we're just like so we're way too old like to use TikTok for ourselves, but for the podcast, like we're gonna bite the bullet. Yeah, because we're, we're going to try to do um, YouTube shorts, yeah. so that's kind of like the same as TikTok, so we'll yeah. throw them over there, and then on Instagram, if we get one of those things going, that'd be cool too. 
uh, you can do shorts on there and whatnot. And then uh, probably a lot of just um, behind the scenes footage stuff, I think. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. So, um... What can they look forward to? Ooh. This season. What can you look forward to? Like, why Why should Why should they, like, commit to us? For, yeah, like, you definitely should season? submit to us. Submit? Like, commit. I said oh, commit, commit, but yeah. submitting's fine, too. Uh, yeah, what she said. That's way hotter. Um, so... <laughs> Um, no, uh, I don't know. I think um, like last season we gave we tried to give out some like uh, healthy mind tips. You know what I mean? Keep your brain where it's supposed to be. Like um, not like advice, but just like opinions. Yeah, um, it's tough to give advice because nobody takes advice. So you yeah. kind of got to just plant seeds in people's heads. That's what we we're doing. I and, feel like and let them think about it on their own. Mm -hmm. And sometimes those seeds will grow, and then you know you can change your mindset. If not, it's cool. You are who you are, and you're perfectly you, so don't be a dick. Yeah, and be, just be nice. It goes back to the being nice thing. Like, if you're nice, you put out, like, positive energy, like, things will be positive back towards you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Karma. You gotta, you gotta speak to the universe. Yeah. Um, so, I, I think we're gonna try to do more of that. Uh, get, get, you know, just put you guys in, like, a healthy mindset. Uh, we're gonna do... Oh, I think we're gonna try to do some like product review, opening, unboxing, yeah. stuff like that. We're definitely um, gonna do that. We're not sure what we're gonna do, what kind of products we want to do. We kind of want to do something towards like this podcast, so like something that me and Ashley both are into, or one's into, and the other's kind of curious yeah. type. If deal. you have any suggestions, or you yourself like have access to any products comment. that you would like to see us try, eat whatever like yeah just comment you know what i mean and uh we'll probably also get a mindset email as well so this way you guys can also just contact us via via email and let us know you know what i mean what exactly you're looking to give to us throw on the table yeah. but if not just comment on the youtube video yep and like it thumbs up because we deserve thumbs up we li I like all the thumbs up yeah. and the snaps I only learned how to do that like 10 years ago. Snapping. You should be a pro from three years off. You should be snapping like a motherfucker right I now. I can't really. It's still like not natural. She's like, it I haven't been It feels weird for my fingers. Like they don't like it. They're like, what are we doing here? Maybe it's the nails. You got nice nails. Thanks. You show the camera your nails. They're pretty badass motherfuckers. These are scratchers, y'all. Scratchers? Yeah, somebody, somebody somewhere in the world is benefiting from them. these. No, somebody is catching these currently. Just one person. Oh, I meant like a violent act. But yeah, but like I said, just one person. He's getting it. He's getting it. Oh, he likes it. <laughs> <laughs> when he pisses me off. I see where you're going with that. Happen, I got you. You know what I'm saying? Got like, you. scratch his head to sleep, got scratch you. his throat open when he makes me mad. I got you. Claw it out. Claw it out. Yeah. That's cool. It works I got you. Out, yeah. So, um, yep. And then uh, also, we're going to, like she said, we're going to do more, like, like field trips, more field trips. Um, so, Twitch, we can stream. Uh, pretty sure I can just do it with my phone. I know you guys might want like better quality, so um, we do uh, we do uh, have a, a, a streaming camera that we're gonna give a shot to. But yes. um, we're gonna try to make that shit happen. So love, um, it. love that for us. You guys can catch us outside if you want. Mm -hmm. um, we don't fight though. We're lovers, not fighters. Even though I actually got them claws. I was going to say, like, only, speak for yourself, like, Dane. Like, I am not. Like, no, I might. Don't throw all your cards on the table. Just let them know you don't know karate and shit I like that. Yeah, no comment. Right. So. No pictures. No pictures. No, no comments. Questions. No, questions. no questions. Uh, yeah, so we're going to be um, trying to move around. Get out. Uh, yeah. I think we're still we're still gonna have special guests. Um, we are definitely gonna have special guests this season, and there's one special guest this season that I feel like it's gonna be, it's gonna elevate our game a little bit, and also it'll be a familiar face to a lot of people, which I feel like is a great thing to offer. Yeah. So stay tuned for that. Yeah. Um, these are all in the in the in the works. Yeah. Um, hopefully we'll have David Redding. Um, David Redding yeah. Might have a. Uh, almost expert gun expert on um who knows who knows what else we're gonna have um so i don't think we were oh we're doing a 40 ounce redemption but like i might not do 40 ounces i might do like four high noons duct taped to my hand or something so we're doing some kind of redemption there because i definitely 
I saw myself on that first season not be able to drink that 40. And, like, me now is ashamed at me then. You know what I'm saying? And, like, I need redemption, like, for me. So if you're doing four, maybe we could tape two to your hand. <laughs> one's not open. The other one's open. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You and, then you open the, yeah, and then you open the other one. That was my thought process. I'm not stupid, Then Dane. we take this off and we put the next one there. You open this one and then you get you No, I think it's just four the whole time and then you just open them as you go. Like, uh, yeah. Stone Cold Steve Austin stuff. Yeah. Yeah, it'll be fun. Plus, Drunk Ashley now, way cooler than Drunk Ashley then. Like, I was literally sitting there, like, I think post-credits. Like, it's one of my favorite post-credits. Cool I was going to say. It's me just playing with the lighter, like, super drunk. Like, I was so drunk, you could hear it in my voice. I was, uh, and after that episode, we shot, like, pictures. <laughs> like, that's the thing. I was, yeah, like, was wasted all day. Like, so <laughs> I need redemption. Yeah, that was a that was a good challenge. That was fun. That, that was, was a That was a fun day because we uh, ended up taking a field trip anyways with that. Mm -hmm. And then we went to the um, went to the skate the warehouse, arm. which I'm yeah. actually wearing the T-shirt for right now, and it's called Warehouse 54 in Lancaster. You can find them on Instagram, and if you are a skater in the area or you are like visiting or anything, you can send them a message and uh, send them some money, and they'll send you the key code, and you can rip this bowl, which is like literally in a random garage in Lancaster, uh, actually kind of near where 551 West is. A lot of people know that place. So, yeah. I don't know. I don't know where references like to where that is in Lancaster, but you get it. So you can just hit him up on um, yeah. Instagram. Really good guy Yippee. that runs that place uh, named Chad Kramer, who is pretty well known around here for his like skateboarding history and stuff. So some people like might know that name. So yeah, if you hit him up or hit up like just the warehouse individually, like he will get you all set up with that. And that's always, I mean, that's a great thing to give money to as well, like, for the skate. It was community. legit first time going there, Not, I'm not going to lie. It's, it's pretty cool. You just would never expect that walking I believe there is doors. a video on my Instagram, if you want to check it out, of entering the yes. warehouse. And yes. it's pretty legit. Yes. And, and like, you can see good. on their, their Instagram feed, too, just tons of videos and stuff. It's literally, like, just such a prime bowl. Rippers. Just a bunch of rippers, yeah. A bunch of different rippers. Rippers in different stages, for sure. Yeah. So... That's that. And, like, they have a possum as their, like, you know. Mascot. Yeah, it's, like, cute. So. That's cool. It is cool. You're cool. I appreciate that. You're pretty cool, too. Oh, thanks, Dean. Um, what else? I feel like, uh. I don't know. I don't know. You guys are just going to have to stay tuned. Yeah. Like, there's nothing else for right now. But there's plenty for, like. Later. Soon. <laughs> <laughs> very very soon <laughs> huh. see you guys bye